Hey everybody, it's Greg Victor here, and in this video, I'm going to show you how to find unique locations for your photo and video shoots in your local area. All right, let's get started. All right, let's talk about a couple of different places. So you may have some old forts, depending on where you live. Try to find some maybe historic sites. So in this example here, there's an old fort in Halifax. It's called the Citadel. And actually right now, it's open for free. And I just kind of found this out by mistake. I've been there before, but I walked by. And now that COVID's on, they're less strict about bringing professional equipment. So it may be a perfect time for you to shoot somewhere where normally you would need a permit. You might not because things are scaled down so much. So look into your local areas for free spots that you could shoot maybe old forts maybe old museums pack light so you don't look like you're going to do a full-on photo shoot and then work quickly so that's what we did when we were shooting at this fort but also too look for areas with graffiti so sometimes you'll find an area that has a lot of graffiti so this can give you a unique background there's a couple of different spots that i was able to find that had some really cool graffiti backgrounds so that's also useful also colorful murals or paintings on buildings or walls uh, that's also helpful as well just giving you a different sort of perspective and now a couple things to think about too is as you know you do photo or video look for leading lines look for shapes look for just things that are going to look unique and give you depth to your photograph now as well too you can go to these places at night it really depends on the situation now a couple of these situations I just went with natural light, but also incorporating flash could give you a whole different look to your scene. Now I'm going to put a link below too that will help you to find unique photo spots in your location. But also too you can join Facebook photography groups and see if you find some spots that maybe look unique and then maybe you could message that person too so if you're having trouble finding these spots on your own then maybe message some fellow photographers in your local area if you see a location and sometimes it's just about going out and exploring with a lens so let's say you throw on a 35 mil prime and you just go out you search out some locations you go back and you look at all the images and say which one stands out here is it the leading lines in this boardwalk or is it this particular wall or is it this particular background then you can plan a shoot with say a model or friends and then you can go back to that location knowing what you want to shoot so that's helpful too because then you know the perspectives that you want and you can work quickly especially if it's a place where normally you would need a permit once you know how you're going to shoot it what focal length uh, what aperture then you can go back and work quickly so just a couple of tips about how to find these locations and how to prepare to shoot in these locations so anyway i hope you found this video helpful if you have any comments or questions you can post them down below if you found any of these tips helpful hit the like button and also if you're not already a subscriber just hit that subscribe button hit the bell notification and then you'll be updated when i release new videos anyway thanks for watching this video really want to hear your feedback on how you find unique locations and perspectives for your photo shoots or video shoots post them down below i think other people would really like to hear from you anyway thanks again for watching it's great back to here hit that uh, like button thumbs up and i'll see you in the next video okay that's enough okay now let me just i just i just want to get a shot of that light there that's enough okay <laughs> okay so here i just want to get a shot of this okay. yeah that's what rob said he was looking for a man yeah. Okay, I'm gonna get Rob in a video man pose. That's a man pose? No, I'm just trying to, it looks like he's in a, oh look, he's a security guard, look. He's a security guard. Hold on.